एवरी वन इज डिटर्मिन आई मस्ट किल दुर्जोधान वॉज डिटर्मिन टू किल भीम एंड भीम वॉज डिटर्मिन टू किल चौहान दे डिड नॉट लिसन टू द इंस्ट्रक्शन ऑफ बलदेव देन बलदेव लेफ्ट द प्लेस ही वेन टू द्वारका बैक अब को कृष्णा वॉज दै बिकॉज कृष्ण वॉज टू गिव हिंट to bhima how to kill duryodhan so duryodhan by the blessing of his mother his whole body became iron like solid so by beating by the bhima it was not easy uh, so the story is that Gandhari, the mother of Duryodhan, uh, she was a great chest woman. Uh, because her husband was blind, she used to remain as blind woman, covering the eyes. But she had some power, chest woman. Anyone. We stick to the regulative principles. He gets a power, spiritual or material, gets power. A brahmachari gets power if he follows brahmacharya. Uh, everyone, if we follow the prescribed rules and regulation, automatically become power. So, uh, Gandhari had some power. So his eldest son, Duryodhan, was advised to see the mother naked. She advised, "My dear son, tomorrow morning when you come to offer your obeisances to me, you come naked. I shall see you, and you will be solidified, dressed like art." So she was going uh, naked. The Krishna saw, so he asked him, "Where you are going?" That this is the I am going to see my mother. Say, "How is that? You are going naked. At least you have some lamota. Uh, this is not good." Uh, so he took the instruction of Krishna and covered the private part with the lamota and. When Gandhari saw, she saw that she was not fully naked, so she regretted. Ah, my dear son, I asked you to come before me naked. Why you have got this? No, Krishna advised. Then she began to smile that my attempt is failure. So Krishna knew it. That part which was covered, that was not turned iron. The other parts turned into iron on account of sin by Gandhari. So in this fight, uh, Krishna hinted, "Bhim, uh, that you strike here. That part is not ironized. Uh, although it is against the regulative principle." To strike the opponent party below this waist, Krishna advised, unless you transgress this law, you cannot kill. So he was struck below the waist, and he was not killed, but his waist was broken. That way, it is said, because there are bhikkhu gadhabimans. But then he died. 